Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more of our EU4 So Japanese pirate campaign here. And uh, we are going to, I think actually, we're going to have to annex this dude. But after that, we can reunite Japan. We can click the button and that'll be fun. So let's see what we can click here. Build buildings. So I don't want to go too deep into that. One of the following must be true. Oh, permanent claim on a bunch of Madagascar. Cool. So this actually gives us permanent claims on a bunch of areas. So that's cool. Uh, have at least one admiral with total pips at least 12. The all a mighty pirate trademark. Um, yeah, I need to get more trade ships, more light ships. Let's go ahead and get a few more. These guys are going over to Beijing. Oh, we already got them being recruited, don't we? No, oh, there we go. Cool. So, let's see what's going on here. We have not entirely decided, but I am leaning humanist. Just because uh, rebels are kind of annoying. So, humanist is probably our best bet. Um, it's either humanist or expansion. But we're going to go humanist for now. Um, looming disaster... Internal conflicts, a lower unrest than whatever, that will go down, and uh, yeah, we're fine. And looks like you came out way ahead down here, so these guys are going to be... I would rather not have rebels there if I can avoid it, so it looks like our dude died after... Oh, he finally died. He finally died. He had five more years, too. Rest in peace, uh, Yoshimoto So. Entrepreneur, very good. All right, I don't care about that. Let me have that sweet, sweet um, professionalism, baby. Let's go ahead and suppress rebels up here. And we're gonna wanna start annexing this dude sometime soon. How is he doing on all of his so he's actually cored all this. Very good. Full cord. Cool. Let's get to work on that. It's gonna take some time. But luckily for us, we are not uh, taking any Diplo ideas, so we're good. Let's go ahead. Do we need to upgrade any of these ships? No, we do not. What about these guys here? We can upgrade all of them. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, actually, we cannot upgrade them. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, continue privateering in Beijing. It's actually not that great of a node anymore, which is nuts. Um, this actually might be better to tr blockade to a uh, privateer over here. Not uh, hunt pirates. We are the pirates in this Hanzu or whatever. Let's see how this goes. So, uh, for some reason, we don't have. Come on now. Go do it. Do it. Just do it. Um, we don't have much innovativeness, so I don't care about it. Really, that's it? Let's go ahead and privateer back up in Beijing. Yeah, much more in Beijing. Okay. So this is quite good then. Uh, is Palembang? They're Sultanate. It would be nice to attack Brunei, but he's got so many allies. Oh my gosh, he's got... There's always this huge hug box down here, and I don't quite understand it, but it's okay. I would like to get a claim on this and declare for literally only this. And I could actually do that right now. So let's go ahead and get a claim on this island right here. I think this is actually modern day, um, what is it? Something Singapore. Jeez. Being a dingus. Completely forgetting who think, what, the, what the things are. Palembang, probably want to get a claim over here as well. That would actually be a great way to call in Brunei. Because uh, I would be able to land some men there, siege this down, have naval superiority, siege down Brunei. Break off all of his alliances. 
Right, let's go ahead and go back to a yearly prestige guy or a yearly inflation. Nah, uh, yearly prestige is fine. Let's, uh... Yeah, we'll focus on admin. That way we can have a mill guy. That's fine. Okay, very good. Cool. Let's we'll start working on Plutocratic. Get some naval morale. That is a uh, 20% naval morale. That is quite good. Open or isolationist. It's fine by me. Give me that naval morale. Let's see what our naval morale is compared to everybody else in the world. Uh, naval quality. Uh, morale, four. Four. Just four. Cool. Yeah, I don't think we're going to need to worry about any of that. So let's go ahead and have you guys privateering in Beijing. Let's go ahead. Oh my. F what? Bro. What? How Where did that come from? 85? Where did that come from? I'm so confused about where that came from. Okay, 85 it is. So let's go ahead, let's put all of them into lights. So what is that? That is 27, 27. I might, I might be doing that wrong. Uh, we'll build what we can, I suppose. That's nuts. That's actually nuts. When can we actually raid again? 45. So we got a few years. Before we can get our next haul. Army reformer is dead. That's fine. We'll grab somebody when we can. I would like that extra morale as well. Could probably just take a loan out. Use that to buy a few more guys. I should, actually. So we're going to do it. Fort defense is fine. Stayed up Hokkaido. How's the autonomy up here looking? Pretty bad. <laughs> it's also animist, which is wild. Um, let's go ahead and state this all up as well over here good dev so I'm gonna want to state it up anyways it's gonna help my income so we should do it choose with Chiba is up so Chiba let's come on down here get some claims right oh there we go let's call you back use you to declare war on Chiba have some rebels that are gonna be popping up soon Let's go ahead and declare war. No CB, apparently, because I'm a dingus and I never prepared one. I wonder here. Ah, even though they're an independent daimyo, I'm not going to be able to do anything with them. Unfortunate. Or even though they're a vassal, they're technically considered an independent daimyo. Uh, army tradition for your... Yeah, that, that's fine. We need the army tradition. Let's see here. What are we? What more are we capable of? Another. There we go. That's actually nuts. We should probably see if there's anything better. Oh yeah, like we want to be. We want to be down here now. Let's go ahead and privateer down in Malacca. Now check this out. We went from two something. Oh yeah, all those ships are going into Beijing. Here we go. Very good. Let's go ahead and have you guys privateer down in uh, Malacca as well. 
Hmm. Hmm, I don't really care about the pretender rebels a whole lot. Oh, it would change their government to a monarchy. Are they not a monarchy? Yeah, it does say that. That's weird. I guess we're taking out another loan. That's fun. Let's go ahead and get a claim down here on this island here. Nope. There we go. Okay, we do not have much, so we're gonna... Dreaded Captain. He's old. And he's un cruel. That's so fun. Let's just get this dang thing. It is only their right. Southern Korea area. So in Jeju? Don't care. It's a lot of unrest though. Enraged, Iko Iki. Unruly Samurai. So what is that? The oh, 49. Dang, we have a lot of national unrest. Look at this. Positive two stab and we still are like just getting crushed by it. Okay, well, let's just get this uh, two more months. Oh, apparently I'm gonna suppress that rebel for him. <laughs> kind of funny. Cool, we got our morale. Now we can uh, actually focus on getting tech again. Let's see here. Does anybody over here want to... Uh... Oh, they're all gonna hate me because I... Because I killed off or I stole a bunch of their stuff. I raided their coasts. Oh, wow. A lot of devastation over here. When can I do this again? 44? 44. 44. Alright, cool. Let's get that claim here. Declare the war. Go ahead and blockade. And siege. This national unrest. Oh wait, hey, check that out. Never minus two and minus two. So we'll get minus four national unrest for the, both of those ideas. So that actually might be worth uh, rushing. Very cool. Let's just go ahead and suppress rebels over here. And eh, whatever. Let's just get them everywhere, I suppose. I'll take the, the monies. Very cool. So Taiwan. <laughs> I like that. Let's get you guys down hunting Ugh, I keep hitting hunting pirates. Uh, what about the Malakas? How is the Malakas looking? Not so much. Get you guys down into Malacca. I will not give them anything. Cannot be assigned a leader if out of supply range. Let's go ahead and do that and then have you guys privateering Malacca again. Guess I will now lose some money. Let's see here. There we go. How are we losing? Oh. With admin. There we go. Buccaneers are going to be good for our Republican tradition. Korean separatists. Man, yeah, that's unfortunate. They are definitely gonna pop too, and there's not really a whole lot I can do about it, unfortunately. Hmm. Yeah, this like cycle of rebels is just gonna be something I'm gonna have to deal with, unfortunately. Explore or not. Yeah, that's fine. Been struggling with money for a lot of this. Hmm. How much are we actually collecting from privateering? Not much, man. We're really not collecting much. Huh. What's going on with all these guys? Yeah, we've raided literally everybody. Looks like we're gonna have to get up, start working our way over here. 
Oh, we can't even see it? Jeez. Let's just go ahead and uh, have you guys hold still. Let's go ahead and have you guys come over there. Have you guys privateer in Malacca still. Let's get a explorer and have you go handle the Andamans. That way we can start wiping out all of this over here. It's going to be great land to be exploring. It's usually very, very ferocious though. Yeah, yeah. Not really. Okay, national manpower for 50 years. It's pretty good. Let's go ahead and do that. Global trade power, admin division, or state maintenance. Global. States is probably good as well. State maintenance is usually never really an issue, right? State maintenance is only three ducats a month. Let's go with number of states, that's fine. And um, do we want to embrace this? Probably not. There we go. Go ahead and state some stuff up. No. No, absolutely not. Stop. Jeez. Okay, so we had more rebels somewhere. Mmm. Unfortunate. Let's get you guys over here. Now we're actually making money though. Seems useful. I do, I do want to get these, these two idea groups. This is actually going to give us privateer efficiency as well. So it's probably for the best that I just hold out. Go a little bit extra behind Miltech. It's not a big deal. Alright, so... We're going to be able to annex these guys very soon. Four loans. Yeah, we have a lot of interest. Huh. I think we're going to be able to start... In March of next year. So, how are things over here? January. What was the first one? August? So, we can certainly start uh, working our way around. So, I think these ones are the first ones. Very good. Let's come on out down here. Here we go. December. All right, cool. So we'll wait till December then. Mm. Let's have you guys stay in charge so we can get that Republican tradition. We're going to need it. Oh, man. Lots of rebels. Particularists is kind of corny, though. I don't know why they're particularists. I should probably try to move my capital down to uh, Australia. But I don't know, it is considered its own continent, so I don't think I actually would be able to. Right, let's go ahead and start uh, doing our raiding stuff. Mm. There we go. Uh, nope. Right, let's do this this little round first. Totally good. Let's go ahead and make sure we're paying off our debts as well. Very good. Don't think we can reach there. Nope. Beautiful. Whoa. 131 ducats. Okay. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Keep it up. Another 24. Okay, very good. Wow, we are just like cruising through these. Gonna be able to pay off all of our debts. Which I love, because we're pirates, and we're plundering in order to pay off debts, which is just so poetic. Go. 
Taking a lot of attrition for some reason. Kinda don't know why. Let's go ahead and get you guys over here. Very good. Just destroying Brunei. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at all this devastation. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so bad. Oh, I love that. Look at this. Look at this. They don't stand a chance. They do not stand a chance. Okay. Very good. Get them all. Get them all. And then... Make our way up here. Down and around this way up here. And there we go. So good, man. Come on, baby. Get up here. Take out Ryuku. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, that was 100 ducats. 33 ducats. 82. Oh my gosh, this is so much. Let's go ahead and get those uh, unrest. Plus, it's going to help our privateering, so it's really good. So where are these rebels even going to pop? Animus, Zealots, and Tainan? I don't think so. No rebels in for me. Yeah, that just uh, lowered our national unrest by an incredible amount. So when we annex these guys, we'll actually be able to click the button and form Japan. So might even be able to do it today. Basically, I just want to speed five it for a moment until... Admittedly, our expansion hasn't been as quickly as I feel like it could be. There we go. You're so rich. Raid mechanic is broken. Broken. There we go. Very good. Oh, cool, let's get you guys down there. Let's speed five it for a moment. Let's go ahead and have you guys explore over in India. And let's go ahead. I have no colonists to send because I fat fingered and now they're doing something I don't want them to do. Very good. Get you guys over there. Now let's go ahead and send one or two single merc units over there. There we go. Have the transports take them over. Inflation reduction is probably good. We still have very high inflation, so. There we go. Let's actually see here. Things are going quite well. I wonder if we could get the. Um, no. Excuse me. Nice little sneeze there. Let's go ahead and have you guys privateer in Nippon, see if we can actually get that, uh, that 20% we're looking for. Sorry guys, keep sneezing. Oh, perfect. There we go. Now we can get that uh, uh, ship trade power, trade efficiency, very good. Built the force limit, it's all fine and dandy. Pirate Horde, 3,000 gold. Gives us prestige and calf cost, which is kind of funny. Any ally has enacted Pirate Republic. Ganges Delta. Gives me a bunch of permanent claims, I think, right? Yeah. So it's, now that we got that one done, we don't actually want to privateer our home node, so we're going to have you guys privateer Bengal. That's Ganges Delta, I think, right? West Bengal. Ganges Delta. I always thought that was weird, that it shows me... Like, it says, Ganges Delta, Camoran Cape, or Thata. This is Camoral Cape, or whatever, instead of Caramandal. Like, why is it naming the sea tile? It's not right. But anyways, let's go ahead and kill those guys off. Have you guys get brought up here. 
And, uh... Ooh, looks like Ming is taking some bites out of their, their neighbors again. Let's go ahead and say we hate you guys as well. And I'm actually going to insult you guys scornfully to let you know that you suck and I hate you. So I can keep large PP. Um, as for tech... I would like to get some land over here from Vigianagar. I don't think it's going to happen. I don't see how it would happen. Unfortunate. Unless I were to know CBM. I could. I don't want to lose the stab though. Support independence from Dali. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. So let's go ahead and get everybody up into the mainland. Finish our annexation process here. So we can click the button. Oh, I remember. We built a bunch of those buildings. No wonder we had all that all that uh, power projection. We now can not click this? Wait a minute, what? Where are they at? I could have sworn that I said to go privateer in Bengal. And they're just not going to do it. Okay. That's really weird. I don't know why that happens. Why is it an option if it's not going to do it, right? There we go. So now I can click it. Permanent claims over here, which I will actually totally do. Let's make sure that you have been explored. And we can actually totally... Um, raid this stuff now, so let's do that. Very good. Beautiful. Oh, 18 more ducats. 37. Beautiful. Don't think we'll reach this one down here. But uh, we will reach this one over here. Beautiful. Cool, so let's actually see here. Caramandel is probably the best one to, uh, to privateer. That will actually hurt everybody downstream as well. Portugal. Pirates. Somebody else is pirating here. Malwa. Well, that's about to get a lot stronger now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, we're making quite a bit of money from over here, so it's a good thing we're here. Um, Alright, let's speed five it until we finish the annexation process here. Oh, wait, they quit. They quit uh, pirating. Why are you... Why do I have the option to do it if it's not going to actually do it? So annoying. Um, let's actually go to Malacca instead. We need to have the money coming in. We need to make monies. Our golden era is done. Feels bad, man. It was fun while it lasted. Let's go ahead and convert these lands. Let's finish up our annexation. Uh, okay. Okay, very good. Keep it going. Keep it going. We uh, totally could attack for this now. Kilwa. Malindi. For this guy who has Mombasa. I think it actually makes sense to go ahead and do it. But we're going to wait until we form Japan. Because I need to do it. I want to click the button. Dang it. I want to click the button. And I'm going to do it. Far from ideal, he says. Okay, it's going to be about another year and a half before we can click the button. It's produced is nice. All right. We haven't been attacked again, which is nice. Ming has insulted us. I would like to justify like a trade conflict against like you. Korea would be a good one. Um, there's a uh, lots of hug boxing going on over here. Let's go ahead and build some spy network over here, because I think we actually could do it right now, actually, if we had the 10 spy network. Let's go ahead and make sure we see all this stuff down here. I know I'm not, like, quick to unite Japan. It's not about being quick. Ooh. Printing press is here, so that means we can now do this guy right here. <laughs> um, we're probably going to... Mm. 
Admittedly, I don't want to put any money into it. Um, we're going to take mill tech first. So let's go ahead. Can we fabricate a justified trade conflict? We can. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and blockade ports. Shun won't even join. You will. So this is fine. And um, navally, we should just completely outclass them. So I'm going to have you guys blockade enemy ports in the East China Sea. And then that should literally just... You should just do it. Integration is a slow process. I can now click the button. It's weird that I don't have to be at war. So we will then become an empire. So it's a good thing we didn't uh, embrace any of the institutions. And I'm not going to take any new ideas because we want these beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ideas. So uh, no, we cannot abandon our roots. Certainly not. So we're just going to blockade them. Yes, blockade them, yes. Give me that ticking war score. Okay, cool. All right, guys, I will take this mill tech, and that will do it for this one. So, hope you guys are enjoying, and if you are, please show your support and leave a like on the video. It helps a ton. Subscribe if you have not already, and if you would like to check out the Discord or support us on Patreon. Let's go ahead and see what's going on over here. Uh, the links for all those are going to be in the description below the video. And with all of that, this is Chewy Shoot, and I will catch you guys later. A big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yudaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.